fucking can. Have your clips synced and ready. You need to have extra frames on your second clip, as I have here. Add a null layer above the two clips and trim it to your liking. Duplicate the null layer a few times. Parent the first null to the second and so on. Now parent both clips to the first null layer as I do. Now click on the first null layer and press S to open the scale option. Set a keyframe at the start and set the scale to a very large number. Then go to a few frames before you want your second clip to start and set it back to 100. Press F9 to smooth and open the graph editor. Copy my graph. Now move your second clip about 20 frames to the left. Press S and P on the second clip to open the scale and position options. You want to position the clip so that it nearly blends into the first clip. Lowering the opacity on the second clip can help this. There, now time for the transition. Open the position and scale options on the second null. Set keyframes to where you want your transition to start. Then go to where you want the transition to end and zoom in on the second clip. Press F9 to smooth the keyframes and open the graph editor and follow my graph. Now open the opacity on the second clip and set a keyframe at the beginning and set it to zero. Then move to where you want the clip to be fully visible and set it to 100. Smooth the keyframes once again and follow my graph. Make any adjustments you need to the graphs. Add motion tile to the second clip. Don't forget to add motion blur to all clips 